as UK and EU officials continue their efforts to reach a Brexit trade deal by December 31st, Belgian customs and logistics companies are preparing for an uncertain outcome. Zeebrugge could be checking more than 80 containers per day from next year, compared to barely 10 scans and checks a day on average before Brexit. The work is also going ahead to stockpile and ship Europe's biggest brands to British supermarkets before the New Year deadline heralds new trade barriers. We're still trying to be ready and up to date for a deal and for a no deal scenario. They are two slightly different scenarios, so we need different information. The Belgian company has even contacted retired customs officers to seek advice on how shipping used to work before the single market reduced bureaucracy and opened borders. But the Belgians are not sure that everyone will be ready. There'll be also truck drivers coming here from Romania, from Italy, and they'll probably know nothing or almost nothing. They won't have the papers prepared. In Calais, at the entrance to the Channel Tunnel, the prospect of delays and recurring traffic jams linked to Brexit is already testing the patience of truckers. It's not impossible. The, the next day is not, not possible. Me, again, no going for England. Yes, now go back in Greece, in Greece speaking with my boss, never, 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 not, not impossible. After half a century of close economic integration, the new challenge of Brexit is turning into a leap in the dark. Robin Owens, Euronews.